There'll be no more of this, please, even if you were once the president of China. Beijing is cracking down, especially on public spitting. And this as well. Zhang Huigong is a government-appointed Miss Manners, trying to bring a little etiquette to the masses. This kind of behavior is uncivilized, and people should feel ashamed. In a city where push comes to shove on a daily basis, communist leaders are worried what the world will see when the Olympics come to town next year. So the newly created office for orderly bus riding has sent out thousands of so-called civility supervisors, like the very stern Mrs. Wang.、Mm. The problem is we have too many people. She told me the last I heard we had the biggest population in the world. And the government has ordered better behaviour from travelling Chinese after this embarrassing crush at Hong Kong Disney last year. Not enough tickets, too many people. For Yu Sai Quan, a kind of Martha Stewart of China, the official decorum directive comes not a moment too soon. What turns me off is that they don't even know what they don't know.、Uh, they think that this is the kind of behaviour they have been living,、uh, and then they, that's acceptable, and it isn't. And for those who don't know, well, there's always etiquette lessons, a very different class struggle for these businessmen, where they learn to not talk with their mouth full, to sip, not slurp, and which is the right fork. City officials believe manners are getting a little better, and they know this because, true to communist form, there's a civic index, a kind of etiquette scoreboard of pushing, shoving, and public spitting, and it shows that there's still. Plenty of room for improvement before the Olympic Games. And so, with much fanfare, the government has launched an official campaign telling Beijingers it's glorious to be polite, because after all, you never know who might be watching. John Vores, CNN, Beijing.